it's Anne from Anne Ellis Angels. And I'd like to do a little run through of my two main card decks. The Teacup Tarot and the Time to Shine Oracle deck. Now, these decks work very well together because that's how they've been designed. That's how I made them. So if we start with the Time to Shine Oracle card deck, this is really a training deck to teach you how to read tarot. So, for instance, it has five suits, same as a tarot deck has. It has 21 wisdom cards. They're the high energy cards. And they relate to the major arcana in a tarot deck. The other four suits have been made to echo the suits of a tarot deck. So action cards here, literally taking action, relate to the wands suit in a tarot deck. Emotion cards, all about emotions and how we feel, relate to the teacups or the cups suit of a tarot deck. Again, about emotions. The thought cards relate to the pencils or swords suit in a traditional tarot. This is how we think, how, we, how we're processing thoughts, how we go through our day, any, if we have any concerns or anything. That's what the thought suit will cover. And finally, the life suit relates to the coins suit in a traditional tarot deck. Life, I chose that because very often it means jobs, career, home life. These, the names of these suits, action, emotion, thought and life, all are a clue to what each suit is going to talk about. So we've got the 21 high energy wisdom cards. And in this Time to Shine deck, we then go from card one right through to card 10. The only thing, the only cards that the Time to Shine deck doesn't have, that the Tarot deck does have, are the court cards. So, for instance, that would be the last four in each suit. The page, the knight, the queen, and the king. So when you're first using oracle cards or learning how to use them, the Time to Shine deck, on the bottom of every card, has an explanation of what the card means. So, for instance, Zero of Wisdom says, follow your dreams, enjoy new opportunities. You can do it. When you use that card and you learn that that's what that number of that suit means, you can easily pick up a tarot deck. That's the same card from the tarot. Following her dreams, enjoying new opportunities. She's all packed and ready to go. So starting off here with the Time to Shine deck, when you're using that and you read the little prompts at the bottom of every card and you get quite good at that and quite familiar with that, the next step to a traditional tarot deck is really very easy. So when you watch my readings on my YouTube channel, you will see me using both decks together. That's how well they work together. They've been designed to work together. So the Time to Shine deck can get you going with the cards. The prompts are there to help you. The suits are there to help you to get you used to reading different suits and then picking up a tarot deck 
will be simple and easy. And the only cards you will need to familiarise yourself with are the court cards. It's about 16 cards you would have to learn. There are 62 cards in here and 78 cards here. So I hope you've enjoyed this little bit of information all about my decks. I hope you really enjoy the decks. If you want a closer look at them, you can see my readings every week. And if you would like to purchase either of these decks, Anne Ellis Angels on Etsy. If you have a look in there, you'll find just what you're looking for. So thank you for listening. Hope you've really enjoyed it. And I'll see you soon. Thank you.